Hey, it's the goon take once more with my little finger guns, because that's pretty cool, isn't it? No, homie. Uh, I'm still trying to figure out what the best setup is. So here's a new setup. <laughs> it's a thing, isn't it? I did have the light on so that it would be brighter, but I had the freaking fan on and it looked like dog duke. So I took that shit straight to the trash where it belonged. Speaking of trash, uh, I'm currently watching some Al Smith videos. Um, not that he himself is trash, but uh, I don't know where I was going with that. But I'm watching now. That's the point that I was trying to make. <laughs> Woo! Uh, speaking of things that are offensive to the eyes, I got the uh, 40th anniversary He-Man, guys. And I'm going to say this. The box is pretty nice. Pretty nice box. Back is pretty nice. Uh, new chest sculpt is pretty nice. But that face is hideous. Look at that face, guy. Atros. And it just slips out, so that's cool. I do like these kind of collector-friendly boxes that they've been doing. And, uh... Oh, man, they come with the little freaking twisty ties, guy. The little plastic twisty ties that make it obvious that you've opened it. That face is bad, guy. Alright, so I was posing this boy to take some pictures, and I noticed that he actually has a wash on his boots. A black wash that looked pretty nice same on his loincloth interestingly I have a black wash on my loin but it's not a uh, it's not paint it's a uh, freaking grime and grue because I don't wash them uh, and as you can see throughout his legs he's got kind of a, a brown wash too um, here's a better look at that hideous face <sighs> It just looks like an annoying lady, you know, like you want to kick her face in. Uh, here's the accessory, the sword, and of course, the axe, and he comes with his little gauntlet. Here's the boy with the shield. The shield's cool, but it should be a little more dirty or something, or like, broken up. But yeah, pretty cool. Head, hideous still. What I wanted to find out is if I could head swap the Origins figure, if I could head, head swap this one with the 40th, but as I can see here, it looks like the colors are different. So maybe not. Yeah, I think the color's a little too off. Like, it looks okay in camera, weirdly, but in person, the color is... It's not great, and also, as you can see, he's a little shinier, the head, than the rest of the body, so it looks kind of weird. Uh eh, unfortunately it doesn't look cool. They put this like weird shading on his face that just looks bad. So that's weird. As an old ode to the old figures. It's pretty cool. I do like the bigger chest. I just feel like this head misses the mark quite a bit. Looks kind of weird and whack. Man, I don't know. I'll give it like a 6. Maybe, nah, you know what? I'll give it like a 7.5. It looks pretty decent in some poses, and if you can look past that bad shading on the face, it's pretty good. It's just slightly underwhelming, I think. And uh, overall, this is just not amazing. Much like this video, that's super not amazing. We got a dog and some uh, soup that stinks, <laughs> so that's pretty cool. <laughs> but most importantly, we got Ahab. <laughs> Can't show his face, because his face doesn't exist. Want your opinion on this face? <laughs> this He-Man face? We saw, uh, if you've seen our channels, you, you know that uh, we were part of a cult. <laughs> and there used to be this sister, quote unquote, oh, in no. cult that looked like this guy. Her name was the Hermana Macias. Oh no, it is Macias, guy. <laughs> <laughs> so it'd be like four-year-old Mexican women. <laughs> Pretty cool. God damn it. I will say it looks a little better out of the box. Like, in the box, it looked terrible. It looks a lot different, yeah. But, but uh, it's still so not good. Yeah, so. Stinky pale. Stinky pale. Suck on my fucking testes.